Please welcome Mr. Eddie Pepitone, you guys, come on. I'm an actor here in Los Angeles, and now uh, one thing I really hate doing is, um, because I'm very anti-corporate, and I'm very anti-society, yet I'm poor, so I have to go on commercial auditions. And I really fucking hate them because the commercial world is just the silliest ass world, right? I mean, you ever see the commercials? They are the worst, are they not? It's like everything is always like it's just this. Everything is great in a commercial. Like, honey, how did you get the shirt so fresh? <laughs> and but I can't do it that way. Like, if that's the commercial, I'm always so pissed off just by the time I get to the audition because just of the traffic. I, I, and just because of the conditions in, in our country right now, I'm sort of, you know, the way I do that commercial is like, <laughs> how'd you get it so fresh? <laughs> like they can always, the casting people can always sense my anger, you know? They're like, no, Mr. Pepitone, say it with a smile, you know? Say, so I'm like, how'd you get, hey, honey! How'd you get the fucking shirt so fresh? No, Mr. Pepitone. No, no, just kind of just talk to you. You know, you're just happy about the shirt. Baby! <laughs> Sweetheart! How'd you get this shirt? Sweetheart, where the fuck are you? How did you get this shirt so fresh? I mean, the illiteracy rate in this country keeps going up and up. One out of every six adults is in prison. People are in mental institutions all over, yet you still get the shirt fucking fresh. How do you fucking do it? When, when wild dogs are running rampant in LA fires, how do you do it? It's the apocalypse out here. People are eating each other. People are being gang banged. Yet you get the shirt. So fucking fresh. How do you do it, baby? Come out, come out wherever you are, you bitch. Where are you? You motherfucker! Don't hide from me! Thank you, Mr. Pepitone. Callbacks are next week. Please don't come. <laughs>